friends, welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new. So in today's video, as you can probably tell by the title, I'll be sharing with you three easy and healthy baby led weaning recipes. These recipes are also good for toddlers and also for babies that just started with solids. And yes, I totally get it if you're a first time mom just like me and you're scared to give your yes, and you're scared to give your baby um, food and have them feed themselves. No pressure. You can absolutely give your baby these recipes, this food and just give them like little pieces and feed them. Also, I'd like to thank everyone who are subscribed to this Hi. channel. Yes, yeah, say thank you everyone. We now have 100 subscribers on this channel and I'm really, really grateful to each and every one of you here. And yeah, let's go Hi. into the video. So for blueberries, you can either use frozen or fresh, it's all up to you. I am just coating them with a plain flour. You can also use gluten-free if you'd like. Next, I'm adding in the egg as it helps with the structure and texture of the muffins. And then I'm adding in some sugar-free maple syrup. You can also use maple sugar. It's just a healthier option than the refined sugar. gonna beat the egg with a maple sugar with a hand mixer for about three minutes to get a fluffy mixture. Next I'm adding in the melted butter. You can also use oil if you want to and mix them again. And now I'm adding the blueberries coated with the plain flour. And then I'll put the coconut flour. You can also use oat flour or almond flour. It depends on what you like. Then just mix them all together. Just be careful not to over mix. Next, I'm adding a plain Greek yogurt. And then just a pinch of salt. some lemon juice and then some baking soda and then I'll prepare the small muffin tray and then spray it with some oil you can use olive oil spray or coconut oil if you like but I just didn't have one so I just used the canola each muffin is just a tablespoon. Then bake them for 15 to 17 minutes at 350 Fahrenheit until golden brown. And there we have it. Yummy! Woohoo! Yummy! Yummy? Are you excited to try them? Miguel, are you excited? What's your fave? <laughs> yeah? <laughs> Yummy! So I'm just going to wait for it to cool down for a couple of minutes, maybe five minutes. And yeah. Ooh, look at that Miguel. Wah. Which one? Which one? <laughs> Ooh. Ah. Ah. 
So uh, the first thing I'm doing is to boil some water. It's just three to four cups of water. And then I'm peeling the sweet potato. And then I'm just gonna chop them into cubes. put them in the steamer with the boiling water and boil them for about I'd say 10 minutes or just until the sweet potato is soft enough and then I'll transfer them into a bowl and start mashing them just half of the banana the riper the banana the better next I'm adding in all the dry ingredients the maple syrup and then just mix all the ingredients together Now this is optional but I added a little bit more of the maple syrup and then start mixing them again. In a baking pan or a tray just spray some oil and then get about a tablespoon of the sweet potato cookie mixture and just form them into a bowl. cookie balls using a fork in the oven bake them for about 190 degrees celsius for 20 minutes finally they're ready In a hot pan, I'm just gonna add two to three tablespoons of olive oil. And then 
I'm adding in the broccoli and stir fry it for a little bit and then next I'll be adding the carrots as well we're only gonna stir fry it until it's half cooked because it's gonna cook through in the oven anyway Then I'll just transfer that in a bowl. Oops, excuse me, Miguel. Next, I'm adding in um, the the eggs in a separate bowl. And I'm adding in the Italian herb mix and the uh, the rest of the ingredients. and I don't know why the footage where I transferred them in the pen was not recorded but yeah here's how it looks like and then I'm gonna place them in the oven and bake them for 15 minutes or until golden brown and tada it's ready let them cool down for a couple of minutes before you slice them into pieces <laughs> watching this video and make sure to give it a like comment and don't forget to subscribe to this channel and we'll see you on the next one bye say bye say see you next time bye <laughs>